Welcome back guys. Today we are going to do something that has been asked for for a little while. But before we get to that, comment down below on what you tow or camp in. Maybe it's motorhome, fifth wheel, travel trailer, and what you tow it with. Also, stay till the end of the video because we are going to be giving away a haul gauge. And this way you can get all the information. That way you can, you know, have one for yourself. About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see. I'm on my own today. Kara's at work, so I thought I'd do something that she finds kind of boring is I'm gonna check the weights of my truck and trailer. I've already weighed my truck and trailer before, but um, we haven't videoed it and done a full comparison with using the haul gauge. We did the haul gauge this winter with the snowmobile trailer and all those sort of things, but the fifth wheel was still covered up for the winter. So if you wanna watch that in full detail, there should be a link up above and you can do that or go search through our videos and you can find it there. But what we're gonna do, uh, we're going to go through, weigh the truck first on the cat scale. Then we will do a comparison with what the haul gauge comes up with. Then um, we will hook on the fifth wheel, check pin weight, all those sort of things, which haul gauge has all sorts of features that show you how to do all that sort of stuff. And from what I've experienced is really accurate. Then we'll drag the fifth wheel down here and run it through the cat scale to see what we come up with and to see how accurate the haul gauge is. So come along as we go through and weigh the truck and the trailer and all that sort of stuff and see what we come up with. We have our first weigh in and with just the truck and me, we're at 8160. Uh, now I'm gonna go use the haul gauge and see what I end up at. To get your base weight on your tow vehicle, what you do is you do a few 30 mile per hour accelerations um, it's going to give you a little bit of variation each time, but you should be able to kind of get it pinpointed where you're at within a, a little bit, a few percent each direction. So I'm down here in the fields uh, below my house, and that way I can do a few accelerations without having to worry about traffic. After doing two accelerations, it came back at right around 81, 8,200 pounds, right at the same as the cat scale. So my truck is all calibrated. Now let's go hook on the trailer and see what we come up with. The next thing that we're going to weigh with haul gauge is the pin weight of the fifth wheel. So I'm going to go ahead and back onto it and see what we end up at. I have 3,300 pounds left of payload capacity after myself full um, tank of gas and the hitch put in. One thing when you're doing the pin weight with the haul gauge is you have to shut your truck off because the rattling movement of the truck will kind of throw off the weighing. Now that the trailer's all on the truck, the haul gauge came back saying right around 2,300, a little bit over 2,300 pounds. So we can go and test and see what we come up with with the uh, cat scale. Hopefully it's pretty close. Just got off the cat scale and our truck and trailer combination came to 18,480, which is below our gross combined weight rating, which is nice. Um, the trailer is coming in like 10,400, something like that. And the uh, pin weight is 2340. So now it's just time to go and let's just see what we come up with the haul gauge. The cat scales said we should be around 18,480. Um, and with the haul gauge, we came in right around that again. So overall, haul gauge was right within the parameters of being really accurate. The haul gauge makes a great way to, you know, keep track of your weights. Uh, right now our trailer has a little bit extra pin weight because we have the upholstery being redone so there's not all the couches and stuff in the back kind of counterbalancing so it makes it a little bit heavier in the front but it's good to always know kind of where you're at. We are going to be giving away a haul gauge. Follow the link below and you can, you know, enter to win a chance to have a haul gauge and we'll get that sent out to the winner. Uh, We'll give a few weeks to, you know, give everybody a chance to get entered. Like, subscribe, all those things to get those extra entries. Um, all the rules and that sort of stuff will be listed on the website. Uh, and as always, thanks for watching. 
Uh, we really appreciate it. It's you guys subscribing and liking and commenting and all those sort of things that allow us to be able to do this. So uh, thank you very much for watching. And as always, enjoy your weekend. What do